Hello guys, Branko here from Micree. I just wanted to say we are glad to announce major updates of some of the Micree products. Nectar Studio ID got updated, Code Reprogramming Debug Device got updated as well. In terms of the Nectar Studio, the major thing we got is microchips compilers. Yes, MPLAB XC compilers are now part of the Nectar Studio. You can choose between 8-bit, 16-bit or 32-bit version of the compilers. That being said, you will be able to use clipboards with the 32-bit version just like that. How is that possible? Well, Micro SDK, which is a set of embedded libraries inside Nectar, is now ready to work with the 32-bit version of the compiler. That is one thing. The other thing we've done is face lifting of the Nectar Studio. UI UX has been updated. Fonts, splash screen, landing page of the Nectar. White and black themes have got a little bit of a natural look. Okay, on to the second major update. Codegrip Programmer Debugger Device. Did you know Codegrip is the world's first programmer debugger device over Wi-Fi? Well, that programming part of the Wi-Fi just got boosted. We boosted programming a microcontroller over Wi-Fi for about 50%. That is one thing. The other thing, 252 newly added microcontrollers at your service. You will be able to choose from microcontrollers which are in the high end of the embedded industry spectrum, capable of advanced processing capabilities. On the opposite side, you will also be able to select microcontrollers for low power applications. You may be wondering, how can I test all of these for free? I think I have an answer for that. Visit micreecom slash Nectar. Install Nectar. Open up plan debug feature. After that, Connect to some dev board of your interest over this boosted Wi-Fi connection. And finally, go to Package Manager feature and download the example code of the clickboard which is physically installed on the dev board you selected. And that, my friends, is how you can prototype your next project. Fast-paced, time-saved. Thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next one.